Hola, soy Javier. Os quiero enseñar cómo funciona. I want to show you how the software I develop works for a JetiCut extension that does not need a connection to work, and the JetiCut commands arrive to the card via wireless. This is my TB6550 card. It has four channels, and this is the printer connector, connector that we normally connect directly to the LPT1 on our computer. Here we have connected an Arduino compatible Wemos D1 Mini, that is an Arduino with nine digital outputs, just to handle the card, but it has native Wi-Fi. As I have not connected the USB, I have to supply it with 5 volts that I have taken from my car through the DB15 connector pin 15. In this Arduino, we have the server software. It generates a Wi-Fi and waits for the connections of the clients. Let's see the client. This is the client. We connect it as we would connect our Arduino to the USB, and we wait for it to connect through a TCP IP socket. As long as we do not have connection, the client will blink. Let's power the server. And we have connection. As we are going to cut, I will turn on the table and then jerry cut again. We start cutting. Let's light up here. Well, you have already seen that the piece got a little toasted because, having no temperature control implemented, I have set a very high temperature. Now, I want to disconnect the client first and then connect a new client to my laptop. This one is much faster and probably needs this temperature. I reset the server, connect the client who will immediately get, its, get his connection and turn on Jetty Cut again. Inmediatamente conseguirá su conexión y vuelvo a encender Jetty Cut. You will see it moves a little faster. That is why we needed so much temperature. And this would be it. You see that I have to improve the temperature control in this new environment. But the software is now available for you and it will surely save you a lot of work and you will take advantage and enjoy your time as much as I have enjoyed it. Thank you for your attention. Best regards.